Hello, welcome to Everything with Dofan. So today I want to say something about um, the power of um, having a covering, a spiritual covering, especially an earthly spiritual covering. A lot of people get offended while they're in the church or while they're seated under someone that is supposed to help them. And they began to misbehave. When you look at the story of Elisha and Eli Elijah and Elisha, you will understand what staying under a cover means. But at times we get offended and we shift out of that covering. And then the enemy attacks us. Uh, someone will say that I'm spirit filled, water and blood. And um, I know scripture and I can rebuke the devil. Thou says the Lord. Just like Jesus did, you know, when Satan came to tempt Jesus, what Jesus did was to say, thou says the Lord, you know, thou says the Lord. And some people will say that, okay, I have scriptures for every problem because there are scriptures for every problem in the Bible. Why do I need a covering? I don't know. But for me, covering has been so powerful because I times are slack. And if you know that the devil looms around for children of God, he sends monitoring spirit and what have you not to watch what we are doing, to see when we have fallen or when we have come, come short. We are humans. <laughs> At times, the Holy Spirit will be telling you, don't far pray. And you'll be like, oh God, I'm tired. It happens to me most of the times. Oh God, I'm tired. I just want to sleep. And uh, you will fall and sleep and attacks will come. But if you have a covering, which is a prophet, a pastor, or someone you submit to uh, that is praying for you, that you know that is praying for you almost all the time, then surely the person might be praying for you and his prayer could, could cover you. So for me, I have a fantastic and wonderful, uh, fervent, uh, sleepless, um, Earthly covering, which is Prophet TB Joshua. <laughs> when people say that, uh, Dofan, people are going to come for you, I laugh. Because when you come for me, you have to go through my prophet first. Yeah? You have to go through my prophet first, which is Prophet TB Joshua. And you know he doesn't come easy, right? Uh, and forget it, we are not the same. People keep saying that we are all the same. We are loved the same. We are children of God. We are not the same. Efforts matter. Effort does matters, and Prophet T.B. Joshua has put a lot of effort uh, in what he does, and he's my spiritual father. So I walk fearlessly, yeah? I walk very fearlessly. I'm not boasting, but that's the truth. I walk very fearlessly. You have to go through Prophet T.B. Joshua first. If you go through Prophet T.B. Joshua, then you will meet Jesus Christ of Nazareth. When you, you, who can stand against the Lord? Who can stand against the Lord? And before you will move through Jesus, Jesus will sit and watch most times. Most times we think that immediately when we call on God, he just intervenes immediately. At times he watches to see what we can do by ourselves first. So if you come for me, you have to go through my covering, which, which is prophet TB Joshua, my prophet, the man I sit under. And then uh, you will go through God. And then who can come against God? Who can come against God? So um, the power of spiritual covering is very, very important. It's there to support us anytime we are shot. It's there to support us anytime we fall. Uh, since I rededicated my life to Christ and have been straightforward and honest, uh, I can say that things have gone a lot wrong, but they would have been worse if I haven't had a cover. You know, and at times, uh, our fathers in the Lord and at times God himself will watch us see whether what would this thing we desire. We really want and we, we are going to put in an effort towards it to see whether um, we desire these things. You know, God needs to, God works with our desire. Today, I want you to know that you need, need an early, you need an, a spiritual early covering. God is going to cover you, but you need that covering first before another one. I have benefited so much in them, my early covering that at times I physically see it. Like you're in a dream, something is about to attack you and you see the image of your spiritual father coming to attack that thing. I have seen them on numerous occasions. I don't know whether you have experienced that yourself. If you do, uh, do communicate with us in the comment section and then we can rub minds. I have been so privileged to have... um. A relentless, a sleepless, and um, and not giving up 
prophet as my cover, you know, and I submit unto his authority. I submit unto what he has been doing. And that means that when you're submitting to him, you know what you're submitting to, because I'm saying that not for you to go and say, okay, I'm going to submit to my prophet. Even if he tells me, go and find a kid, I'm submitting to my prophet. No, you know, um, you have to submit to him because you have earnestly seen him closely. You know what he does in his dark, what he does in his secret. And you know that he's submitting to the almighty God and that, like that you will be more powerful. This is a very serious issue, but I'm, I'm, in, I'm not in Abuja. Mm -mm, I'm not in Abuja. I'm um, somewhere in Nigeria, though, to cover an event for uh, someone that has, has been very close to us, a, a family friend, you know, to cover his event and be part of what he is doing in his community. I might not mention his name because he's a very prominent Nigerian. Uh, and, mm-hmm. That, that is that. I can't say more than that. But uh, maybe later you guys will see the pictures and the videos and you understand. But I have rules. I have some things that uh, I don't just say some things. Well, in the time that I'm, I'm right deep inside the, the ocean, I don't want to give them up, you know, um, and that is it. So I am not in Abuja, but uh, I will talk about this uh, covering, spiritual covering uh, deeper. But I know, and especially this time, this year, huh, I have seen what my earthly spiritual father has done to me. His covering, I have literally seen what his covering has been doing to me in finance area, my spiritual area, my physical area, and every 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 aspect I have seen him. And you know, at times it's easier for God to know that he can speak to you through this means and that other means than to try to uh, uh, look for whatever means he's going to speak to you. And the spiritual covering comes with that too. God can use your spiritual father, someone you trust so much and you believe so much in, to actually uh, communicate with you, be it in dreams, vision, open vision, or while you're lying and asleep in your bed. So I have been so privileged to have a fantastic covering, to have a wonderful covering, um, be it in in, prophet, in prophecies, you know, um, year 2019, Prophet T.B. Joshua, that was December. I was even in church when the prophecy was released, uh, 2019, ending of December towards January. And uh, he prophesied a lot of things that are going to happen this year. That is what another covering does to you. That is what spiritual covering, at least spiritual covering does to you too. You know, he was able to release some prophecies and he kept us awake. He kept us waiting. He said that this year, a lot of Christians are going to give up. So because he said that this year, a lot of Christians are going to give up, I was equipped with just that prophecy, you know, to be able to say that, okay, whatsoever comes my way, I am not going to give up on my God. You know, if that prophecy had not come, maybe I would have just been, oh, I'm tired. That is one of it. When you have spiritual covering, that is one of it. And we listen to a lot of people and then we confuse a lot of things. Sit under one person. Whether things are working, whether they are not working, we have seasons in our lives. So whatever season you are, if you like run to one million churches, if it's that particular season and there's something you have to learn from, you have to learn from it before you can be elevated or before you can leave that particular season to another one. And uh, you cannot keep running from one place to another because of a particular season. Instead of you to sit with the Lord and allow him to, to teach you what is that in that season that he wants you to learn. So uh, basically that is what uh, another aspect of the covering, of spiritual earthly covering that does to you. I have been so thankful to Prophet T.B. Joshua that he prays for all of us. He prays for all of us. You know, some people say that he puts picture here and whatever, whatever. he's praying for us. He's praying for us and that has gone to help. A lot of things uh, have gone to help. You don't understand why somebody is doing something. But some of us, the Lord will open our eyes to see. He prays for me every day and I have sensed it. I receive it and I sense it in my spirit because I'm a praying woman on by myself. Uh, I'm going to do another video immediately after this one. If I have time uh, during the break or during the lunch time from the event, I will make another video. My last video uh, about waking up in the night to pray has really brought a lot of controversies. And a lot of people have sent me email. I have no reply because it has been stressful. After the success of my CEO awards, I needed to go around and greet the people that made it successful. You know, the top politician that attended and made it successful. 
successful and after that i had to hurriedly come to this place it has just been crazy you know but uh it's for good and it's for the lord's glory i'll be talking about that video i will elaborate more you cannot do some things because you might not have earthly covering. I can dare because I have earthly and heavenly covering. Covering. After having said that, this is where I go. But this is the importance of you having an earthly covering. A pastor, a bishop, a prophet, be it anybody that you trust and you believe. You don't submit to people that Holy Spirit has not ministered to you about them. You don't submit to people that you don't know what they do in their secret. Because when you're submitting, if they tell you stand, you're going to stand. Because you believe that the Lord has spoken to them. If they tell you sit, you're going to sit in most cases. Because um, that is what it is. So you have to submit to someone that you know that is doing God's will genuinely. And when you discover that it, it, the person is drifting, you, you move away. So I'm going to talk deeper on um, submitting to, author to spiritual authority that covers you uh, on the earth. Uh, that connects from heaven, apparently does better than you, sees better than you, knows better than you. Like if I have to go through spiritual battles, uh, what am I expecting? You know, some of these people, because they have gone through that route, they can put you through. So basically that is that. Having said that, this is where I go. I am going to speak deeper on this issue with biblical backing and some other things. But today I just want to be thankful because this year without spiritual backing, without sitting, uh, listening to what man of God have said, his direction and everything i don't think um i would have been saying i'm ending it stronger than the lord as it is so um spiritual backing has done so much for me and i am very grateful for everything thank you jesus thank you prophet tv joshua uh thank you everybody that has helped to make prophet tv joshua successful he has left the church this year most times being in the mountain he has been praying this year so much but the church has kept going to encourage us and to to do everything i want to thank everybody in the church uh that have been holding help helping prophet tb joshua to hold and lift the kingdom of god up hi having said that this is where i go i love you all i will see you again when i see you bye bye